Now, I recently stayed in a hotel, so I'm an absolute expert on hotels. Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome to Hotel Renovator, a game coming soon to Steam. This is an early preview build from the developers that they've sent me, but soon you'll be able to play the demo for yourself, and then eventually the full version of the game. I, for one, really want to see more hotel games come to Steam, as we haven't really seen many of those over the last few years. The first that I can remember being like uh, Sim Tower, and then, of course, followed up by games like... Uh, well, of course, we got our more recent Project High Rise and Mad Tower Tycoon, which are pretty cool. But I want to see some more hotel casino builders, mall builders, and more, though this is more in the style of House Flipper. So if you've always wanted to own and operate your very own hotel, but also like House Flipper and many other of those cleanup games, such as a Railroad or what is a Train Station Renovator and also House Flipper or The Sims, this kind of gives you that same vibe just in first person. So let's go ahead and jump in and have ourselves a first look at Hotel Renovator. And by the way, thank you guys for all your support as we're rocketing towards 1 million subscribers. It's awesome. Thanks again for subscribing to the channel, clicking and tapping that notification bell, turning it on to all, and smashing that like button. Man, that van is like Ghostbusters. Woo! Let's go. I'm excited. Okay. And we are here in the beautiful, once beautiful hotel. Like we have an uninvited oh, guest. hello. Let's show her who's boss here. Catch her. Catch who? Oh, I hear a chicken. You gotta be kidding me. Why does this give me the hotel vibes from uh, Last of Us? Oh, interesting. Catch a chicken and throw away chicken. What? You do not do that. You turn them into nuggets. Get over here, you. What are you doing here? I expected rats, but not a chicken. Get over here. Ah, hey, hey, hey. Were you living here? Yay. You gotta pay rent. Be able to do it to be honest now we have to get rid of her throw her out the window in the hallway she'll like the fountain throw her out the window in the hallway what ma'am are you serious out there oh boy this is gonna be crazy look at all these rooms to renovate too oh this is gonna be cool if we get to decorate them all and change them up a little bit uh enjoy the fountain goodbye how do i throw you away there's the fountain oh press e f there we go Ooh, goodbye. Okay. Mission complete. Now what? Welcome to the demo version of Hotel Renovator. We're so glad you've joined us. Sorry about the hen. Nobody invited her. As you can see, the hotel is in disrepair. We need to put a lot of work into it. And yet, we already have guests waiting to stay here. A film crew decided that the interior of our hotel would be the perfect setting for a music video. Really? They will arrive soon, so we have to prepare a room for them. This music video? Task. Are you kidding me, ma'am? This would be like a haunted, like, everything. Alright, what do you want me to do exactly? We'll be filming a music video for an up-and-coming rock star. It might be difficult to impress them with a one-star interior, but limitations stimulate creativity, as some people like to say. Bear that in mind and go to room 101. Okay. This is 105, 106, so we're here on the left, I assume. Ah, oh, there we are. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Wow. Who would have thought that it would be us inheriting this hotel from our grandpa? We always stayed in this room during our visits, remember? We did? Ah, good times. Man, this is horrible. This is just horrible. Okay, well, uh, I guess we got to clean all this up by left-clicking, or what? What exactly do we do? Re remove trash. Okay, maybe we should start with that. Let's. Oh, oh boy. Let's remove trash. There we go. So similar to house slipper. Wait a minute. Oh, hold left-click to dispose of. Oh, we got to hold it. Oh no. Oh boy. Literally trash. Okay, we can't dispose of that. What about this stuff? No. Nope. Is this like ramen and stuff? Oh, you, oh no, I dropped it all on the floor from moving the table. What is all this stuff? Oh yeah, it looks like instant noodles and candy bars. Wow. Yeah, we don't want any of this stuff. This table looks like a coffin, kind of? Okay, that's not great. I'm trying to move stuff out of the way so I can... Get it. There we go. Oh, it's blocked by the, uh... Was it blocked by the carpet below? Okay. 
Alright, this stuff should go as well. This seems to just be regular old trash. Okay. So they're gonna film in this hotel room, I guess. Oh, we can hit spacebar to paint things. Nice. Oh, that looks nice, sir. Nope, nope, that looks horrible. Wow, okay, two two sinks in the bathroom. And uh lots of space too. Usually hotels are a lot more crammed than that with the bathroom. Okay. Oh, there's stuff on the floor too, but I can't clean that up. Right click is the remove tool. Oh yeah. Ah, there we go. Oh, oh, we can also destroy the uh Oh, we can get rid of everything. Yes, destroy. Yes. We're harnessing our inner Gordon Freeman now. Oh, beautiful. Okay, now we can just smash everything. That's cool. Except that lamp's pretty nice, but it must die. Oh, boy. There we go. And that looks nice, but destroy. Wait, oh, I thought there was a wall safe behind there. Let's get rid of everything. Why, why not? Let's do the whole interior ourselves. Okay, remove flat uh, floor coverage and wall coverage. You're telling me that if we just hit it against the wall? Oh, wow. It just completely destroys the wall. That's cool. Better than just like, you know, House Flipper is a little tedious with the, you know, having to paint something and kind of like doing it in sections. It's realistic, but also very tedious. And in that game, you're doing, you know, maybe one room at a time of a house where there's maybe like six rooms or something. Here, there's like ten rooms times like eight floors. So it's like, mm, yeah, I don't think I want to paint... 80 walls or well 80 rooms or 100 rooms maybe with the uh, lobby and bathrooms and other things that'd be crazy absolutely crazy yeah let's keep doing the floor oh we should get rid of this too I wonder if can we hit the uh... yeah there we go take that beautiful good old-fashioned destruction can we get rid of the window oh but we can't get rid of the wall there we go cool Okay, things are looking good. Okay, we got 73%, 75% of the wall done, 40% of the floor. I think the floor will be the easiest. And it kind of shows you what area it's going to do in that yellow mark I just noticed. Get rid of the cabinet. Let's get rid of uh, the space behind it. There we go. Perfect. All right, this is nice. Let's see. Okay, let's get that little spot there. A few more there, a few more up top. And we've got a radiator here that's got to go. Oh, this is kind of cool. Oh, we got to go up to the top of the window, down the sides. Beautiful. Okay, it's a nice blue. Oh, that'd be nice. There we go. Oh, this really looks cool. Yeah, this definitely reminds me a lot of corporate offices, a lot of hotels where they kind of, you know, you got to go cheap, but you got to have some sort of design. But they're buying in bulk, so they usually buy a ton of it at a very big discount but it's still a lot of money very expensive now, there's also many colors in this pattern too so we can actually change the color and the pattern at the same time so that's cool so we can go for like a this but in red or yellow or a different pattern that's nice some of these would look nice in red or maybe orange cool all right that's 100 percent of the floor apparently we're not touching the bathroom at all but whatever. Okay, let's do the walls now. Painting. Yes, let's do some painting. Oh, wow, we can pick all sorts of colors. Oof. Uh, are there, let's see, wall uh, cladding, stone tiles, ceramics, wallpaper patterns. Let's go with a nice pattern. Something nice. What, what would look nice in here? Something like this? Ooh, that'd be kind of nice, right? No? Maybe? Kind of weird to see a notch here, too, by the way. Usually you don't see that in the hotel blocks of TV. <laughs> you kind of have an open bedroom, usually. Um, 
Well, let's go ahead and draw the floor. It'd be kind of weird to work around these corners. Working the corner is always difficult. <sighs> believe me. I mean, wait. Don't believe me. Okay, let's work all the way around there. We could do a... Maybe a wallpaper halfway, like maybe at the bottom of this, and then paint the top blue or something. We could just do wallpaper around the base if we wanted to. We have $20,000 to spend, so... Well, I wonder if at the end of this we actually get to see the uh, the music video, too. It looks like the wall's covered still here and there, so we have to get in and destroy that. Even though the game doesn't tell us we have to do that. It would be nice, though. But I guess it's just kind of teaching us. All right, let's keep going. There we go. All the way across the top. Whoa, turbo mode. Oh, I didn't even know we could do the ceilings. Oops. There we go. Is that all the walls? At least out here? Okay. And I oops on the ceiling, but maybe we want a different color other than burnt brown. <laughs> All right, let's go with like a white color, like a, a light, some some light color here. Let's go with a, what was that? Graphics, ooh, oh cool, we could put flowers and stuff on the wall. Oh, they give you all sorts of options. Although, I don't like those, but let's see. Painting, let's go with something light. And let's see, how do we change paint within this menu? You and E to switch between roller and brush. Oh, that's cool. So if you want to blend colors together, you can do that. That's great. That's really cool. Now, how do I uh, change between the colors? The roller and brush is Q and E. Uh, change paint is middle mouse, but that's different types of colors there. Uh, switch between ca category of color and, oh, I see, like that, okay. That's nice. I think these colors would be to get, yeah, these would go together really nicely. Oh, would you look at that? They're getting rolled on. I don't think I can do a large... Yeah, it looks like we paint these in one at a time. I can't do like a whole... whole thing there. An eyedropper tool here would be helpful to go back uh, to areas that you may have missed or to... Oh, is the floor getting... Oh, I thought the floor was getting painted. Wow, would you look at that? Actually looks nice. Okay, let's get out the old remove tool I don't want to be done here that lady's crazy telling us to be done oh wow with stuff you just gotta tap 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 actually those lamps and that uh, sink was fine but we'll just destroy everything do it all, all, all ourselves Man, that is so satisfying when stuff's broken. I hope there's an option to actually renovate walls and stuff and be able to change the designs of rooms and maybe do other rooms too, like penthouses. Maybe we could do the... Maybe there'll be a buffet or a restaurant within the hotel. That'd be kind of cool. There we go. Perfect. Look at that crazy, that crazy crowbar action. Ah, nice. All right, the room is pretty much clear. I think as for the ceiling, we could just paint over it. Yeah, you can see where one of the tiles was missing there, but you can kind of hardly notice it. So if we just paint that white, it'll, it'll blend in. It's fine. It's the American way. Paint over it. Hope no one notices. Charge double the price it's worth. America. All right, perfect. Good. And we're all clean. Excellent. All right, let's put down our tiling again. So we want to do a different floor here. Now we want to do probably a, some sort of a tile in there, a ceramic tile for sure. Not anything stone or whatever. It looks like they had, st yeah, they had stone tiles, but a ceramic tile would be nice. Just your generic um, white tile like that would be okay. Let's go with that. And then is this our lightest color we can do? This color here? Okay, let's let's do this one here. Nice, bright colors. This almost looks more like a house with the hardwood flooring and nice carpet. Looks like a living room and a bathroom area. 
Yeah, that works. Floor is covered. Absolutely. Make sure it all looks good. Okay. All right. Now, <clears throat> inside the bathroom, let's do a little same on the walls here. So let's do more ceramics. Now this time it's going to have to be a different color more than likely than just white. Now we can do white. I think it would all look nice in here like that. Wait, is that... Oh, these are like solid tiles. Oh, okay. Oh, I like that installing noise. Okay, well let's do a like a bathtub here. Sounds like a machine gun. There we go. And then we'll paint the rest of this. So let's go with a different color than the rest of everything else. Maybe we could do some something that looks like a wood color. Let's see. Wall cladding. Oh, and no. Oh yeah, I don't like any of that. Oof. That's gonna be a no. Uh, let's see. Graphics are a no. Ceramics are a no. So, I think we'll just go with some colors here. And we'll pick a... Oh, let's see. I'm still liking the blue. Let's go with that. And then... Blurple. Yes, let's go with Blurple. A lovely color. Oh, this is going to look really nice in this room with the white and the blue, though. Somewhat similar to what we did in the hotel room with the uh, bathroom and the tile here matching the outside with the walls and the floor. And we'll do the same with the ceiling that I think we have to go back to walls and pick a different color so two beds two chairs a table some storage a lamp five decorations and wall decorations nothing for the bathroom though apparently but okay open the Ooh, we have skills oh, available soon oh, okay we can take cash but we haven't done anything yet all right furniture cool well let's start with the beds they'll take up the most room are there more beds we can choose Oh, these are unavailable. Oh, I see. We have to unlock some of the higher ranking ones. Okay. Well, this looks nice for now. And we'll rotate. The Santa Cruz. Ooh. Can we change the color of this, uh, of the cover? I hope so. Okay, well, let's go ahead and put two beds here. So we'll put one here. I hope we can move these later, because I'd like to put a table between these. So hopefully we can, like, scoot it over. Oh, we can. Although, you have to... Oh, no. What? It tri triplicated it. Hold the cell. There we go. Okay, let's add two chairs. And it looks like a table, too. So let's put that in the corner. So we want a table. Something a little different than the Stanford, maybe. Ah, the Brighton looks nice. Yeah, that's a good one. Now, let's go for the... Does that count as a table? Oh, they want an actual, like, big table. Well, we'll put that up in the front. That'll be for the TV and such. Okay, cool. Now, chairs. Yeah, these will look nicer here, I think. A little cramped, I'd say, but if this wall weren't here, it'd be a much op more open floor plan. Add storage now. So storage is where? Shelves? Cabinets? Oh, literally called storage. Okay, well, we'll put that over here. I think this is a perfect fit for this corner. Nice. And a lamp. Bum, bum, bum. Wait, that literally looks just like an orb of light. Well, that's nice. Yeah, right there. That's perfect. Oh, would you look at that? Unfortunately, we can't really get anything in between. We can't, like, free rotate, so that's going to look a little awkward. So we'll just have an interrogation chair over here. <laughs> well, that looks okay. Otherwise, I'd have it over the table. Standing decorations, five. All right, decorations then. But it's got to be a standing one. So we could do the Buddha. 
Oh, the little decorative bowl. Okay. Put that in the corner. Uh, let's see. Buddha. Oh, some vases. An antique clock. Fashion book. That'll be fine. Open magazine. A water pipe. Oh, we could put some things in the shelf, too, if we wanted to. But I think that's better for guest storage. And the candles, just you're just asking for trouble. Totem. And a lot of that stuff's unavailable. So I get okay, we'll do the set of candles on the table then. Although not a great idea. Okay for a home, but uh, you probably don't want that in a hotel. I guess we'll put the Buddha back here. And one more thing. Maybe another candle. There we go. And now some wall decorations. Oh, we can put some mirrors down. Oh, let's put those in the bathroom. Oh, some of these are nice. Well, this is a nice painting. Uh, but something... Yeah, that looks okay. All the blue is like the water. Okay, let's do... Uh... Let's go to Mars. Yes, let's indeed. Is that an advertisement for another one of their games? Okay, now we can put down a few more mirrors in the bathroom. So I think we'll put our sinks here and the bathtub where I'm standing now. But we'll do the double sink thing. Because that was kind of cool. Okay. Lovely. Now for the bathroom and then we're good to go. Ma'am, I already did it. No, damn it. Oh, I knew I shouldn't have got ahead of myself like that. Start by cleaning up and then take care of the fittings. We're you're, you're doing great. Oh ma'am. Damn it, I should have... I didn't trust you, ma'am, and I should have. It's clean, though. Oh man. She's probably going to want me to decorate the bathroom, too. I assume what will happen here is that we just basically decorate, you know, both rooms, and then we charge whoever to uh, stay here and then get money. It probably won't go much further than this. I mean, honestly, once we... Uh, once we get past this point, not much else for us to do, honestly. Like, it's not like... It's a demo, so we don't get the whole access to the whole hotel or the higher levels or anything. I think we made a really good thing here, though. I, I think this is where we would put, like, another long table like this. Like, this would, would be where the TV is. We'd have an alarm clock here, some storage here, including some dressers or whatnot, or build that into where the TV is. And then here would be like maybe where a mini fridge and a stand is with some, uh, maybe a microwave and some other storage for coffee or tea. And then maybe uh, like a coat rack or something and then uh, an ironing board in the corner. And then of course the bathroom. Um, well, your typical bathroom with the toilet, a bathtub, and then of course the sinks. I'm going to try to make this look as nice as possible though. Uh, so let's go ahead and just include those things now. So the game, we got ahead, we got ahead of the game, but you can't blame my excitement. I... I don't I don't mind that I'm stopped from doing what I love, which is messing up. That's right. Let's let's put down a really nice bathtub. Put down a nice bathtub there. Maybe we could put a shower curtain around this. But I'm not sure. Uh okay, so we have a toilet. Yeah, let's do this one. Now I'll have to move the mirror over, I think. Now we could probably put it in the back. Sometimes hotel rooms are a little weird. So we'll go with this. There we go. And then we'll do... Uh, I need some sort of a stand here. Ah, here we go. Perfect. Oh, this is nice. Although we can't put it down. It's blocked by other furniture. Really, that's weird. It's not blocked by anything. I think that might be a glitch. Yeah, there's nothing in its way. Well, we'll do the Jessica then. So let's put a Jessica there and a Jessica here. Observant people would know why I'm calling it that. Uh, let's see. Standing accessories. Oh, yeah. We should probably put something in the bathroom. Oh, yeah. Nice. Let's put a little mirror down. <laughs> okay. How did that even fall off? There we go. How do I sell this one? Oh, now it's just going to endlessly duplicate them. There we go. 
perfect. Okay, uh, let's see. How many other detailed things do we have for the bathroom? Like, can we put down a, you know, like toilet paper or... I'd like to put like a, you know, you put a shower curtain around here. We'd probably have a toilet paper thing next to this. Um, some other storage here, maybe for towels, like between these two. Let's see, toilet bowl. Oh, we do have a nice sofa. Hold on, maybe we should put that in the hotel room. Hmm. Kind of weird, because you'd want to put that where the TV is. But is there any electronics? Shelves, storage, plants. Ah, entertainment. Perfect. Ah, there we are. TV like that. Nice. And we'll just go for freestyle. Honestly, they gave us quite a big budget. I don't think we could spend $20,000 on one room. Okay, that looks nice. And we could do some more wall lamps here. So yeah, let's put those ones back in the bathroom. Well, would you look at that? They're probably off a little bit, but it's okay. Maybe a reading light for each of the beds. Try to get it close, though. We'll try. There we go. I can see it's off a little. OCD alert! Cool. Any other electronics, then? Yeah, I don't see anything else that would be... Aside from entertainment, I don't think that would probably be under there. Let's see, we have stereos, TVs, a smartphone, which you would not give to a guest. Well, actually, no, that's not true. I actually have been in hotels before where you can control things with a smartphone. Like, for example, the TV, or you could rent... Like, you could see what was playing next and rent movies off of it, or, like, control the room from it. Hmm. Carpets and curtains. So we could put a nice carpet here. Ah, yes, we could definitely put one in the bathroom. I don't know why the, the room is being flooded by a carpet, though. There we go. Okay, that looks nice. Just got to find something that's a little smaller here. I don't think we can actually... We can't adjust the size and we can't change the uh, color. But unfortunately, we'll have to go with that. Okay. Put that up against the wall. Nice. Cool. So obviously, once everything's in the room, we can charge a higher price for it. So that's kind of nice. We can put a uh, thing in the bathroom then for flowers. It's not going to have everything, obviously, because not everything's unlocked and not everything's available in a demo. But I think I think we get the point here. And I think it's going to be really cool because now you actually make money for renting the hotel continuously rather than just like a one-time purchase. So if you've got a lot of rooms that you've nicely designed, this whole parking lot's going to be filled up and people are going to be staying at this hotel like crazy. And there's a lot of customization options to it as well. Despite the story of the whole Rockstar and stuff, I, I think we could just easily like rent it out if we wanted to. Uh, yeah, we could add... Oh, there you go. We could add each person to a, a bed and see what, what they feel about it. And then they'll stay for however many days. He's not as happy. He wants a chair. Oh, I guess red is good. She's smiley face. Because there is a... I guess we could put down a, a, a chair. Okay. Actually, maybe a recliner or something like that. But whatever. It's all good. Oh, they don't want to pay more than 60 I see. I think guests are going to stay here now. Let's put down a different uh, furniture, though. Let's try a armchair. There we go. That's what they really want. More than the couch. All right, well, we could put an armchair between. That's a nice big-o armchair. There you go. Then you guys can sit and watch TV. Perfect. They'll be happy customers now. Check the bookings. There we go. Good, two smiley faces. There we go. Still probably need a little uh, little thing here or there, but that's close enough. It's all good. All right, I, bo I botched the demo. I botched the demo because I got too excited. But hey, can you blame me? It's kind of cool to see a game where decorations matter in terms of commercial office. In this case, a hotel. You know, commercial space where it's uh, renting rooms for customers. 
And I'd love to see us be able to do things like, for example, the first floor and uh, do the lobby and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. All right, I want to come on back and do some more of this. So I think we'll do a live stream on this sometime soon, too, and do some ultra chill. If this game interests you, just go ahead and add Hotel Renovator to your uh, Steam wish list. The demo should be around soon. And I have some extra keys for this game to give out. So if you'd like to win those keys, make sure you go ahead and uh, jump on the Discord. Link's down below in the description. I'll see you folks next time. Have yourself a fantastic afternoon. Good evening. And good night, folks. I'll see you soon. Thanks again for all the support as we rocket towards 1 million. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I'll see you next time.